pretty sure that works. What a fail live stream. It took me like four tries, three tries to get this running. Can you hear me now? Man, what a fail this was. Took me, what, three, four tries to get this going? I have to use, I'm using a different uh, streaming server too. So. All right, cool. I'm just switching it up today, Plasma. Are you kidding me? No way. What kind of start is this? to be involved in this so much such an awesome oh, I agree great way to end the year on a positive note rifle I feel the same way every stream and I stream on YouTube so you think I yeah I know oh gosh it's kind of embarrassing pretty much all my like viewers I got notified was probably like okay well yeah nothing's happening here after like the fourth time of me trying to go live <laughs> third time okay so what I'll be doing today I mean as you saw in the description we'll be launching nukes farming events having some fun oh and by the way whoever's in uh, chat feel free to join if you can and are able I am cool with that all right, ready? I love to do unusual events too on the map that players don't, I mean, you have to have a lot of players at like Project Paradise, for example, or Monster Mash every now and then too. I like to do those because those aren't really done much. I don't know how long the stream is going to be, honestly. This was kind of out of the blue. <laughs> and by the way, I, I got like a level up build going on, so perk card setup is kind of awkward. Do we got anyone in a silo, or should I go ahead and get in one? Alright, I'll get in one. Let's get this roll in. <laughs> Everything is going wrong. I know, DJ, like, the batteries die. <laughs> Freaking A. Ugh. That's right, Paladin. That is right, sir. Are you playing on your private or public? I am going public, so everyone can get in here. I'm not doing private server. I'm not, I don't know. Plasma. I do not know, man.
Welcome, Samuel. Appreciate that, sir. No, cousin Todd, nope. Get into the server if you can, man. We'll still do Monster Mash. I was just explaining that, like how I like to do unusual events um, like that. You know, maybe like one or two players, or maybe even three or four, but that's still not enough to really have fun in Monster Mash. Or I mean, you could have fun in Monster Mash, but Project Paradise, no. <laughs> that event, you're going to need more than four. It's not going to be fun. Especially if you want the good rewards to get all the creatures fed well through the troughs. By the way, guys, this is a charity stream uh, for Fallout for Hope. I'm sure a lot of you have heard about it. All donations will be going to St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. If you are interested in donating, I have a pinned um, message, I guess, at the top. Comment, whatever. And yeah, that link will send you to where you can donate if, you're, if you want and are able. And I got a little thing going on. If I do reach uh, the goal that I have set to put into the pot for Fallout for Hope, I'm going to shave my head, and I'm going to I'm going to also attempt donating my hair. So it's kind of like a double whammy for charity, in a sense. Do I have fireproof on? Maybe I should not be using this right now in the silo. Okay. What's that my channel's goal for it? So Dev has so many content creators are involved. The amount we raise as a collective is crazy. Oh, it's absolutely crazy. Um, it's cool to see other gaming communities starting this too. I mean, there's other uh, gaming communities out there that are joining together. Kind of like how Fallout for Hope is. It's pretty cool to see all this happening, especially um, in this year. This year has been a wild ride. It's a cool way to end it. On a positive note, like I was saying before. Eh, I don't want to do that, especially during stream, William. So, it's the old school way you're seeing right now. Or whatever you want to call it, the normal way. <laughs> Oh, come on. With the reload. I'm not gonna... I'm gonna wait to use XP for some more time. Oh. Awesome. Yeah, I was seeing there was something because I was worried about my hair not being a certain length to donate. And uh, I'm going to see what this... There was something... I'm going to figure out what was said. There's an alternative that I can do. Oh, yeah. Uh, it was told to me Matters of Trust is an organization... And they believe that it takes all lengths of hair donations. They could be wrong, though, they mentioned. Uh, apparently, they use the hair to make these special mats that clean oil spills in ocean and wildlife habitats. I thought that was pretty neat. Um, so, who knows? There may be an alternative I can do if my hair aren't isn't exactly long enough.
My guy gets ate up by rads, so... Yeah, this part is not going to be too fun. Favorite weapon in 76 has to be uh, the fixer, honestly. I've probably played with that the most. Can't believe I'm not over encumbered in a hazmat suit. My gosh. World must be in. Whoa, Nelly. Oh, my. Oh, thank you, Mysterious Savior. Yes! Ha ha! Not this time, Assaultron. If you want, you don't have to do the silo with me. You can just hang out and wait for the nuke to launch. No biggie. Honestly, it makes it easier, too, if I do it solo, so... We're out of the place. Okay, okay. Have you know I am a professional guesser at this hacking stuff, so don't think I uh, know exactly what I'm doing when I'm doing this. I know there is a way that you can go about. But, I'm just guessing. There we go. It grows back, man. Oh no. I need to put my armor back on. I'm trying to get a full set of unyielding plus one intelligence so I can really start pushing for XP. I've only got two or three with plus one. No, you got two with plus one intelligence right now. Pretty sure I have some cranberry relish. Uh, nothing in particular. Just oh, unyielding plus one intelligence, ratty. <clears throat> Nothing else in particular. I just want that plus one intelligence for fat, uh, more XP.
Do I have a rad shield on me? That'd be awesome. That'll do. What the? Why wasn't it reloading? <laughs> yeah, feel free, whoever's in chat, if you can, join me. I don't mind. Gamer tags, rifle gaming, I'm on Xbox. Honestly, the more the merrier. It makes it, you know, more fun. Having the server go around doing different events. It's more efficient. Um, exploding guns. Yeah, you can get them as random drops. This one specifically, you can't get anymore. But you can still get explosive energy weapons. Like... Daily Ops. Gauss shotgun, stuff like that. Gold bullion. But yeah, you could get an explosive effect on whatever, really, besides this weapon I have here and a few others. Energy weapons in particular. I keep almost taking myself out. Ooh, Project Paradise! Man, I'm about to unlock the shortcut door and just come back here. Actually, could someone hold Project Paradise down in the server and I'll just try to get this prep for us? Or at least pass this in. Welcome. Why did I just do that? this shortcut door where was I getting shot by oh well project paradise let's meet up guys whoever's in server let's do it We can nuke anytime we want. Project Paradise is pretty random. It can be a while until it comes up on the map. What's up, Cube? What's up, Hunter? Welcome. Nice assassin. I didn't know you were in the server until just now. Cool. Appreciate it, man. Is uh, a cousin Todd in here or who's all in here? I gotta check.
Yeah, I'm on Xbox. Feel free to come join my server. Have a bit of fun. I'll hold down B when we start. Or it hasn't began yet, has it? Please tell me. It has, hasn't it? Oh, nope. Initialize experiment. Cool. We still got seven minutes. Let's wait until we're at, like, I don't know, three minutes or so to start it, I guess. We'll see. Because I think people are still trying to tunnel in. I think some people may be in queue in chat. Wait, Phil. That was weird. Oh, why did we initialize experiment already? Who did that? Uh oh. We can do this. We gotta get them all to 60. Get the best creatures so they can stay alive. I think I got a shish kebab on me to heal them. I don't know. For sure. I think I do. Yeah, I do. Always carry it on me. Just in case. You never know when you're gonna need a shish kebab. Alright, have a good one, Austin. You have a good Christmas yourself, sir. Appreciate that. Toxic sludge, uh, I need to put it in the trough. The thing is, a lot of people don't do this event, so... Yeah, this is what you gotta do. There's three different sections here. That's why you need a, a lot of people, typically, and a lot of people don't come here, so that's what makes this event harder, and why a lot of people don't get to experience it, but... Yeah, three sections, and then those three sections, we have to fill them up, as you can see in the top right. The more I keep delivering, um, yeah, the higher it gets right there. 60s max. It looks like C may need some help. I might go over to C once we hit three minutes, I guess. I don't know. Someone's at C. Personally, this is my favorite event in the game. I like how it takes, you know, team coordination to do it. There's an objective. And then, once you do the objective, you spawn these creatures you have to protect. And if you keep them all alive, you get good rewards. I don't know, I just, I really like this event. If only, like, the final boss was something bigger than and unique. Bigger and unique and instead of just, like, an alpha of, you know, the model. Like, alpha graf grafton monster, alpha, and alpha sheep squatch, and... I think the other one's Alpha Fall Crawler. Yeah, that's for C. But still, nonetheless, this, I love this event. Man, tons of legendaries, too. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, it didn't notify you. I think that is the case for a lot because it took me four times to get this live stream situated. I think after like the second 
notification. YouTube sent out. It was kind of like a done deal. Me trying again and again like that. Getting close to end time. Keep it up, guys. We're doing decent. Nice. Habitat A is done. Good stuff. We can do it. Final call. Here we go. Creatures are coming out now. Yo, thank you, Godzilla. Oh, nothing. I am not in a private. No, I, I like to keep the server open for everyone that can participate in chat can come. Observing effects of formula B on so yeah, I like to keep it open. Alright, here we go, guys. We got a Snally. Oh my gosh, a lot of mole rats going after that Snally right now. I see that. That Meyer alert, keep it alive. Where did our friendly go? I can't see it. Well. I guess I could use that. Aha! Right in front of my eyes. My goals. Oh no! The Snally! Don't worry, I got it. Where is it? No, no. I'm trying to heal you, friend. Man, if my friendly fire was maxed out, this would be more efficient. But it's better than nothing. 
I need help over here. I can't. You know what? Just protect it for a second. I'm maxing it. Ah! Charisma! I'll save you, Snelly. Where'd he go? Okay. Much better. Ooh, that was a close call. Explosive bullet heavy weapon? I don't know. We could take a look at my stash. On this guy. Oh, death claw. He needs a healing. Yay. Oh, we got we completed it and we kept all animals alive. Nice. We should get something pretty good. Good luck everyone. Let's see. I didn't get nothing. But you can get stem pack diffuser. Bear arm plan. Um and bearing modifications too. Like these. I'm gonna scroll down here. Yeah, there it is. Bear arm heavy mod. That's one of them. There's also puncturing too you can get. So yeah. <clears throat> that was fun, guys. What are you dropping, Ratty? Oh, 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 shoot. Oh wow. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Is this the plus one intelligence? Here, I can drop you some too. I think. Here you go. This is a good one. Appreciate it, man. Good looking out. 
I was just looking for the plus one intelligence. That's a good one. You know it. Yeah. Cool. A little bit more. Alright, so now, how many more armor pieces do I need with intelligence? So I got, there's one. Two. I need that one. I need a left arm. Three. Need a left arm and a left leg now to complete it. Oh, wait, no. Just the... Right leg, left arm. Right leg, left arm. Here's a plus one intelligence for anyone that may want a piece for themselves. I'm just going to drop it. It just helps you get a bit more XP having plus one intelligence on your unyielding. Dropping it right here. There you go. Okay, now I can get back to running the silo. We have that shortcut door unlocked. Other pieces I'm missing, I believe it was left leg, right arm. By the way, for those of you just tuning in and are curious on how you can donate towards St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital, I have a pinned comment that I'll send you to a link. All donations go toward the big pot of uh, Fallout for Hope. I'm sure a lot of you have heard about it. But yeah, it's all for the same cause. All donations go to Fallout for Hope and Fallout for Hope you know, goes towards St. Jude's. Basically, it's just the fall community coming together to raise money. So far, we're at 2,840 we have raised um, out of a 5,000 goal I'm trying to get to, to get uh, to put into St. Jude's. If we do manage to hit that goal, I will also shave my head and upload it to YouTube. I'll do it live as well. I don't know if we're going to hit it or not, but if we do, I'll do that. And I'm going to also try to donate my hair, too. Plasma grenade plans aren't rare anymore. No, sir. What's up, Freshly? Eh, it can be a grind. I don't know the exact number, but it can be a while to get the Secret Service jetpack. You talking about getting gold bullion? Think, think you should shape your head on this live stream. 
If we hit it, yeah. Uh. I do not mind to do that. Radiation Rumble, another good event while I'm doing this silo, man. <laughs> I say we do Radiation Rumble. What do you guys say? What do you guys think? Oh, I appreciate that, Prehistoric. I haven't got him, Ratty. Sorry, just seeing you said that. Let's see. Yes? Okay. Radiation Rumble it is. It's cool to see these two events that are pretty rare just pop up. Simultaneous, uh, back to back, basically. <laughs> Let's rumble those rads. Uh, you just type in my gamer tag. You can join my server by just typing in my gamer tag and join the game. My gamer tag's rifle gaming, no spaces. It's pretty easy to find. And then once you get in, just reap the XP and loot. Let's wait to start it. Let's not start it immediately. Let's wait for some other people to pile up here, please, so we can get more people in. Uh, who should run? Who can run? I'll run if we need to be. If, um, if we need a runner. Yeah, I'll run one. I'll gather some more. Oh, I'm over encumbered, actually. I, I'm going to need someone else to run. I'll be able to take ad duty. Let's see, actually. Do I have this? No, I don't have that. Left arm and right leg to complete the set. Appreciate it, cousin. Todd? Appreciate the $20 donation towards St. Jude. Sorry, Ratty. Won't let me trade with you. Meet up at Radiation Rumble, guys. to trade cryptocurrencies. Steve has a watch list for promising. Steve and Dave use e -tour.
Okay. Uh, how long do you guys want to wait? Three minutes? So it's about three minutes, I guess. I'll just start it now. in some work or wait the take for whoever wants in let's do this let's get started then I forgot to get well rested and stuff too before going in. That buff. Oh well. I'm good, Joker. How are you? Sorry, I just seen you said that. A commander mom, would you be able to get it fixed? Oh shoot, sorry you're experiencing that, hopefully it clears up, alright Joker. Uh, it can be. The private server can be worth it. I guess it depends on how much you, how much time you invest into this. And you have money available and stuff. Stuff. Oh 
Gotta love this event. So much XP, so much legendaries. And you can get some pretty rare plans from this. Or a rare plan, I should say. Radiation barrel, and you can get that in the mountain hazmat, too. This lady's wearing that. That guy. I'll Actually. start prepping this stuff up for shipment. There you go. Enjoy your reward. Nice, good stuff. I got a shish kebab rad shield. Dude. To drop some of the stuff I got up here. Someone wants a shish kebab for healing or something. I'm also dropping script. guys go. Bunch of script and whatnot. Let's see. Hello Rifle, your videos always manage to make me laugh. Please keep making more happy holidays and hope you have a I appreciate that unwanted warrior. Appreciate that man. Happy holidays to you too. Hope we have a good one as well. Yeah, sure, I can go check the stash. Actually, speaking of, have you guys seen this camp? I don't think I've shown this to y'all. Um, I've shown some... I've showed it a couple times, but... I don't think I've given a tour. Oh, what's up, Sunrise? Welcome. Yeah, I've given a tour over this camp on Twitch. I mean, on YouTube, I haven't. I showed a little bit of it during a video over testing, experimenting with the shelters. Yeah, there's typically a human NPC that spawns here. Oh, here he is. Random guy. Have him next to the fire. Looks as if you know he's making the fire here. Um, it's a little shanty town I got going on. I tried to incorporate the environment. The idea of this build is to incorporate the cranberry environment as much as I can. And no. I gotta save my scavenger. He's a crazy guy. He just runs out to super mutants with a an axe. I gotta repair it all too. Oh my gosh, a lot of things are destroyed here. 
But yeah, let me give you all a tour of this place. I'm excited to actually officially get it out as a YouTube upload, but I'm still polishing it. You'll see. I probably shouldn't have shot that. Why is everything coming here? It's typically not like this. It's not this bad. I don't know what's happening. Oh, gosh. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I know why it's happening. It's because I'm live streaming. This been fail after fail after fail. It literally took me four tries to get this live stream rolling. Thank you, for Pete's sake. Alright. Now we go ahead and repair all. Oh, what the? Okay. I got everything I need. Gourd and corn. Gourd for cranberry relish. I'm just going to scrap them. So I can repair all. For some reason, it doesn't let you repair all if you don't have all the room. I guess it makes sense why. Okay. Let's see if that does the trick. Okay. Jay Kittles, I appreciate the uh, $20 donation towards St. Jude's Research Hospital, man. But yeah, so here's the camp. Oh, the guy. Well, typically he's back here cutting up wood. And the camp's supposed to involve the environment, so it's going through the ditch here. farm back here. The whole point was try to incorporate this settlement around the environment. I'm still building it. All right, now here's the shelter. I'll show you all the shelter. Two. Uh, ignore this. I just uh, spammed all these just to get challenges done. This area right here, I haven't really started at all. This is where it really begins. So, it's supposed to feel you know, like just like up above except down here they're researching the environment they're researching the flora um this is just kind of like a little hangout area for them the settlers here or whatever and here's where they would be researching the flora above got these placed in dirt tiles i'm still fixing this up a bit to make it seem make you know i don't know scavenger like i don't want just like a glass here it would look good with just glass there but I, yeah Trying to make a makeshift window. Anyways, in this section, um, it loops around to, you know, where the, the people can sleep at here. Get a change of clothes or whatever. I also made sure up above as well, there's no openings, it's just all wooded. Just to keep with the uh, shantytown vibe that I was going for outside. But yeah. 
All right, let's do silo. Oh, Virtual's got a silo, actually. I'll get the next one then. Might as well knock out the daily. While we're waiting on that nuke to drop. Yeah. I typically don't have that... I don't have too many problems there. Nice place near a fisher. I see what... Yeah, I, I get what you're saying, Danny. It can be pretty hostile there at times. But typically, Scorch Beasts don't attack me there. That was unusual. But some adds can spawn there. I know, right, Cody? <laughs> That's so true, man. Oh, nice, Sunrise. Yeah, I already have an idea of over my next build, but I really want to finish up this what I'm doing. Foundation is a good place. Someday it'll be a great place. A long hard way. It always seems to be Uh, I'm not sure about that, Zeno, to be honest. Jeez, I must have already done my daily. Spike. I guess I could make his cranberry relish. Yeah, that's what I can do. My camp is also by a cranberry farm. Give me some bullion. I would if I could, man, actually. I got a lot I've been hoarding. Oh yeah, something else that I did at this camp. That I didn't show y'all before. Um Check this out. It looks as if this is a ladder or something to get up here. You know, unfortunately we can't climb it, but it looks... That's how the settlers got up here. On the watchtower. If 
favorite color? I, I don't know. Orange? I really like orange. Alright, I'm gonna try to get us some cranberry relish though. Once again, if uh, any of you are just joining in, you can feel free to join me. I'm on Xbox, Gamertag, Rifle Gaming. I know, right? I know, right? Saber Saber. Awesome. Back off a little. Oh no. We got someone running through a silo too right now. I'll try to get a screen very relish before it launches. If it does, it will. I need gourd and sugar. Ah. Crap. What the heck? Cranberry Relish, by the way, in case some of you don't know, it gives you bonus XP. And if you got Herbivore Mutation, and you take uh, Cranberry Relish, you'll get like 25% extra XP, I believe. Something like that. Now I need to go get gourd. Alright, me? Okay. So. If anyone in server happens to have sugar on them, that would help out. If not, I have to mix some. I, I think I have maybe like one or two. Thank you for your cooperation. Hello. Nice. Thank you. Let's see how much I can craft right now. Still gonna need sugar.
Feel free to come down to my camp if you got sugar. I'm making cranberry relish for us to use. Nice, thank you. Oh, awesome. Thanks, shoes. Okay. I made a few. I'll meet it. Let's meet at Scorched Earth. Uh, meet at Scorched Earth, guys. Live, you already there. Sweet. Let's get it. Inert flux. It's basically just like water, except it gives you a little bit of disease resistance, and it's heavier than water. I personally used to use it a lot before food and uh, water kind kind of became obsolete. That guy just appeared out of nowhere. Yep. Oh my. Frank Miller, I appreciate the donation towards St. Jude, sir. By the way. We are almost at 3,000 raised to throw into the Fall for Hope pot. Which, uh, the Fall for Hope pot uh, will go towards St. Jude's. It's just a bunch of Fall community, uh, just a bunch of the Fall community gathering up and trying to accumulate a bunch of money for St. Jude's. End the year on a positive note. This has been crazy. It's awesome that we're doing this. And I just ran out of freaking ammo. That's alright. Come in handy for later. That's a great idea, uh, Aver. I just seen you said that. That is an awesome idea. 
do I play other games? Uh, occasionally. I might jump on an old school game. Or actually, I played Cyberpunk a little bit, too, sometimes. Just depends on the moment, but yeah, uh, this is my main game. This is the game I invest in this time in. I forgot to get the well rested, that's a hunter. And I just died in my sleep. No. What the heck? As soon as I laid down. How is it, bruh? Is it a trustworthy club? Brown moments? I'll be making more cranberry relish here shortly, once we take care of Scorch Beast Mine. I'm also going to have to make more ammo. I just ran out of ammo on my main gun. Now I'm using a fixer, and I, not even a, a rifle build. I'm a heavy build. Oh well, he's getting melted. She's getting melted. It's all good. That's cool. That's awesome, bro. Moments. Hello, traps. Five percent fast fire rate mutants radium rifle. I'm gonna drop it. He has faster fire rate. It's not the greatest, but I might be able to help you farm West Tech or something. You guys want me back up at the camp I'm going to get us some relish going so we have that we can level up a bit faster and progress through the scoreboard a bit faster too It's all good, Cody. Appreciate you hanging out. Have a good day, man. Or night. Wherever you're at in your time zone. Have a good time.
Alright, so who has herbivore mutation? Who needs some relish? Cranberry relish to, you know, help you level up. Anyone in the server need cranberry relish? Appreciate that one two show. Same to you, sir. Yeah, even in a not so well known game, the community still managed to pull these events off. Thanks, Rifle, for stream. Oh, of course, bro, moments. It's insane what we're doing, man. Brain Bombs, yes. Can we combine that with Cranberry Relish? Yeah, Brain Bombs is just intelligence boost, isn't it? You need some rage? Okay, here you go. Making sure I can give out some, so just wait to use it. Come out of hiding, you herbivores. <laughs> No one needs any? Huh. Okay. You said you said you got the brain bombs too? Hey Rusty. Rusty. You're snoring, buddy. You okay? Yeah. You okay, bud? You having a bad dream? Yeah, it's all good. We got them all right. Let me see what all it requires for the brain bombs real quick. Hello, Fall. Welcome. Let's see. Ooh, intelligence boost of eight. I believe that's because I'm herbivore, right? My gosh, that would be awesome. need that uh, sticky Joe thanks man I appreciate it though nah I'm not gonna yeah that eight intelligence I think may be worth it let me go ahead and just gather up the ingredients for this real quick so let's see what should I tackle first maybe yeah sugar bombs would be helpful I'll go get uh, Mothman eggs. Brain fungus, it's pretty plentiful around this area. Around the trenches. I think one's right outside of here. Yeah, there's some brain fungus right there. Dude. If I can make a few of these for us too, we'll get really quick level ups. Plus eight intelligence right there.
My uh, build right now is basically just a level up build. It's all over the place. <laughs> just making sure I have high intelligence. Hmm. I'll make some plasma cores. Gonna need these. It's good enough. Yeah, oh yeah, egghead mutation is fantastic. Uh, I actually have that on. It gives eight intelligence as well. But it lowers some other stuff, as you can see. But who cares? Intelligence is where it's at during scoreboard time. You gotta, get, you gotta farm that XP. What are you dropping right here? Who's this for? Thank you. Was this for me or someone else? Oh. Gosh, you guys are generous. Thank you. Oh, no. I did not mean to do that. Sorry. Appreciate it, squad. And Sticky Joe, I appreciate that. My goodness. And shoes. Sorry. Yeah, I don't think Squad actually dropped something. I think it was shoes. Shoes, you're the one that dropped the junk, right? Oh, thank you, Shoes. I appreciate it, man. Alright, I'm check I'm gonna go get uh, some Mothman eggs too. I guess I could go up here. I uh, appreciate that, gamer. Give rifle more. <laughs> you guys have given plenty. No, no need for more loot. I am good, definitely. Uh, I'm playing on Xbox. Feel free to type in my gamer tag and come join. Right now, I'm working on helping us get some brain fungus. I think uh, some others are as well. Plasma, I think, is gathering some materials. Um, brain fungus really helps out with leveling. Which I feel is the most important when the scoreboard resets. Helps you get the most XP so you can level up fast. You know, get that 100 plus toward the scoreboard from getting a certain amount of XP. I don't have herb... Oh. Green thumb on? What? Oh, Thing about this gun is, it can still take you out, even if you have fireproof on. Scary.
Let me check. Actually, I don't think I do. I think I swapped it. No? Still green thumb. I guess green thumb don't work with the eggs. I do not blame you. No, do not sit in the queue. No, definitely not. We'll be alright. I think this might... We'll be able to make, like, one for everyone, basically. In the server. What the heck? That plate almost took me out. I almost shot the plate. Did you see that whiz by me? Ooh. That would have been insane if that would have actually took me out. Hey, Knighton, welcome. Rifle, I shared your stream on my community feed and in my Discord. Oh, I appreciate that, Ratty. Yeah, it was a struggle getting it started. I had to do four different streams. So, I think I kind of screwed my notifications right there. Started a stream, ended it. Started a stream, then ended it. As you can see, I don't stream much on YouTube. The eggs look like cupcakes. They kind of do. Appreciate the $20 donation, Keyshawn, toward uh, St. Jude's Children's Research. And in this crazy year, on a good note, it's cool to see the community come together like this. By the way, the donations go to Fallout for Hope. You know, which Fallout for Hope is this whole thing where a bunch of Fallout. Uh, fans are basically getting together and raising money for St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. It's, it's awesome. It's a, once again, a good way to end the year. This year has been pretty crazy for a lot of people. Pretty is an understatement. <laughs> Obviously. <clears throat> we got a nuke incoming? Alright. I should be able to make um, some before the nuke drops, I think. Alright, heading to my camp now. I guess we don't need to go to my camp. We can just go to the tent near the fight. Oh, that is lovely, Brandon. Nice one. There is a vault in Fallout 3 with a bunch of clones of this guy named Gary. All they said, ah, oh, yeah, I remember that. All 
Alright. So. Let's see. Who said they had sugar bombs to donate? I'm going to be um, making us some brain bombs. Yo, Virtual. By the way, guys, I believe Virtu Virtuosity here is uh, streaming on Twitch if you want to check out him, too. Cool guy. Uh, do I not want to let, uh, sorry, I have enough, uh, uh, Legacies Mini. Make the brain bombs after this, I guess. Oh, I appreciate you mentioning that, Rusher. Ooh, I got the new ally unlocked, guys. Want to check her out after this, I guess? See if she has a new quest or something? I think she might. Wow. By the way, the description of this video has what I will be doing if we manage to reach the goal for St. Jude's. I'll be shaving my head and also trying to donate it too. So it's a, you know, a double whammy. Well, 
Let's reset the server. Yeah, I just switched up this build to bloody. It actually still has my junkie addictions on it. And I'm using a junkie's weapon still, but... Yeah, I'm kind of switching up them. I'm debating on making a medic's pistol build. <laughs> just because there's not many uh, pistol builds out there. And... Well, they're starting to be more now since the Crusader pistol and just, you know, new, new weapons we can get a hold of, like the Fact Finder and stuff. Fact finder breaks extremely fast though. Alright, I'm gonna leave team. Join in, guys. Oh, yeah, definitely, Ratty. Heck, I didn't even realize you played on Xbox. I feel it, cousin. Yep. I agree, cousin Todd. Like, I also have a Vanguard set. I was... I'm just switching it up for now. I'm a, I don't know what I'm going to do yet with this build. I'm just trying to get uh, level ups. And if you're bloody, that's how you get the unyielding the proc, which gives you more XP. Oh, Mini Joe, uh, I just seen you said that. I think I already have one, man, on my other character. I have five characters that are pretty high level. They started as mules. Dang straight, I'm a food build. <laughs> I'm using brain fungus, brain soup, cranberry relish, you name it, bobblehead leader, as much XP as I can get. I'm trying to grind this scoreboard. I just unlocked a new ally. It's pretty exciting. Speaking of. Alright. So how do I actually get the user at my camp, though? Oh. So just like that, I can already place her. Hmm. Yo, Odious, good to see you in here, man. Yeah, we're just grinding some XP. Alright, let's see what this new ally is all about. Uh, bot. I just seen you said that. Um, no. I appreciate it, though, man. How long do seasons last? Typically pretty long, a few months. Hundred and eighty five likes, what on the video? Dang. Oh yeah, I, yeah, I see that actually. 
There we go. Nice. Appreciate it, guys. I'm just gonna, I guess, put her up here in the restaurant area. Sweet. High fit, but it works. Wait, what? It's green! Don't do this to me, game. Voila. Oh yeah, Odious. This would look good in like your saloon if you still got that going on. Hamburger? I'm not sure that recipe can be rescued. Speaking of, what level are you guys at? Am I doing just curious on the scoreboard. I think I'm on track with the community on my level. Yeah, that doesn't look right there, does it? What? She's sitting there flipping. Wish I can be content with this being somewhere. Yeah, that works. Cool. How you doing? Got my dude over here making a fire. Keep it up, man. 
Hey, bot. All right, let's interact. Pleased to meet you. My name's Yasmin, and I'm a traveling chef making my way through Appalachia. I bet you're wondering why I'm here. That's exactly what I wanted to talk to you about. A traveling chef, how does that work? Do you make a habit of showing up at people's homes unannounced? Uh, I've been a recipe collector all my life, and I found myself on the road again recently. I move from place to place, getting to know people, and swapping stories and family recipes along the way. It's my way of preserving and passing along the knowledge of my trip. I'm looking for a safe place to practice making the local recipes I Camp seems like the perfect spot. Let me set up here and I'll share my memories with you. You're also welcome to buy copies of the recipes I've gathered. Buy recipes? Can't you just share them? What? Uh, no, let's not go with that. So cool, we may get some unique recipes from her. Let's just see what she says. Well, I'll be sharing the food I make, but there is a cost to documenting and preserving the recipes. Think of it as donating a few caps to help me stay strong. I can spend more time turning up new recipes you can't live without. I won't be in your way. I only need a little space for my You're even welcome to use it when I'm not cooking. Imagine the aroma of a steaming pot of apple and chili welcoming you home from a long day of scavenging. <laughs> what do you say? That's cool. Well, I will too. I'll be able to get a lot more cooking done if I don't have to look over my shoulder at the same time. Yeah, that's what I was saying, Cousin Todd. I'm curious about that as well. Alright, I want to make her a little different than how she just regularly appears. Let's do... I guess... Yeah, that's what she's missing. Stash is full. Yep. Grill masters would look better. I agree. It's more clean. I really gotta manage my stash sometime. Hey. So we're still working on brain bombs. How you doing?
I don't need that if that's what you're trying to... Hide. Hide, dismantle. Oh. Oh, shoot. Awesome. Oh, cool. Thank you. Let me try to find something to get rid of out of here. That's reduced weight. Clean up this, fix that. Never seen it. Oh, one second, Ratty. I'll let you know. I'm just gonna get rid of this. Get some clothes on, crazy. What are you doing? Yeah, repping the Project Paradise. How you doing? What's up, Sticky? Gotta rep the Project Paradise. Okay. Thank you. I agree. Boom! Cool! Thank you, sir. She now has her own little restaurant. Man, and check out this stove. You can even see the flames on it. I just noticed that. That's cool. Adding the salt, seasoning it. I see Yasmin. Nice. Mini Joe, you're catching your foot on fire. <laughs> Odious, that's so true, dude. Let me see how much brain bombs I can make us... Oh, AO3, um, I switched the Twitch to YouTube. Just trying it out. <laughs> Boom.
I didn't like com make a complete switch. I'll still be streaming on Twitch, of course. And I still can't make brain bumps. I need a little bit more brain bumps. Good thing it's plentiful around this area. Just gonna follow the trench. Where it's wet and moldy. Okay, I'm not gonna follow that way anymore. See how many I can make. Yeah, sticky. You can dig the ground in certain areas, yes. Yeah, Rusher, I'll probably look into that sometime. I think you have to... Yeah, I'll look into that sometime. Thank you, by the way, Sticky. Appreciate that, man. Let's see how many I can make now. I'll get more purified water real quick. something that tickles your fancy to PvP someone that's not trying to PvP at the moment. I don't know. Seems kind of boring. Anyone got a, some uh, purified water? Oh. No worries. Alright, I have some brain bombs to drop for us. Or, I got two, I guess, I can give. Oh, you need a fusion core, Joe? Oh, I didn't realize. Sorry about that. Yeah, don't worry about donating, man. Here. This is just taking up space anyways. Drop some other junk. Okay. Good. 
good. Make some brain fungus soup as well. Can you combine that with uh, relish though? If you can, man, that's gonna be insane. I can make quite a bit of this. It doesn't require purified. Okay, so... Yeah, I'm not really worried about it right now. I think uh, Hunter, or I don't know who took it, but we Hunter just got us. Nice, thanks. Appreciate it. Okay. So... Here, I got some for us. Here, guys. Here. Here, take this too. Where'd you go? Here's another brain bomb. And soup. There you go. That'll help level. That gives intelligence right there. 
Plus eight. If you have herbivore mutation. Alright, there's someone in silo. Cool. I'm gonna hit uh capital build or let me do West Tech. Let's see how much XP I can accumulate with this now. I think Mooney Joe crashed himself or something. <clears throat> that would be helpful, bot. Speaking of, yeah, let me start up a team too. Hello? Okay. Did that guy just down himself? <laughs> wow. <laughs> he did too, didn't he? Nice one. Alright, um... Now I guess... I'm gonna go to Capitol Building for now. Hey, Handmaid. I like your name. Handmaid76. Yeah, sometimes this happens, Ratty. It happens. <clears throat> you know, I think it's a good thing, though. If a griefer or whatever is wasting their time on you, it's, you know, it's less time they're wasting on someone else. I could care less he's doing this. As long as I'm in pacifist, it doesn't matter to me. All he's doing is wasting bullets and his time. That's up to him. All I know is... If he's wasting his time on me, he's not griefing someone else. So that's cool with me. Because I don't get bothered that much by it. And there's a lot of other people out there that may get, you know, that may rage really bad. So, I'm cool with him doing it.
Yeah, unfortunately, that is true, though. Taking up space in the server, not actually participating, just kind of shooting for no reason. Wasting bullets, I guess. Or just trying to get under your skin. That's the motive, I, I, I think, anyways. I don't know. Yo, Encrypted's up. I'm about to test something. I don't know, that's still kind of iffy XP. Let me check, can brain fungus soup be combined with brain bombs? No it can't, that's why. If I use brain bombs, that'll give me a bit higher of a boost. Brain fungus soup's just something cheaper to make, that makes sense. So now I should have the brain bombs. Yes, cool. Much better. Almost 8 plus intelligence right there, guys, from the brain bombs. Definitely worth it. Hour and 30 minutes, you can use these, too. That is crazy. Alright. Let's check how much XP I get over here at the encrypted event. Have a good one, Ethan. Appreciate you hanging out. <laughs> you just ate some bloat flies. <laughs> Yum. <clears throat> That's okay, Mumbles. It happens right. every now and then. If you're this, it's that means I left part of the. Uh, it's part, kind of part of live streaming. You gotta expect this kind of stuff to happen every now and then. The for a rogue Unfortunately. This thing's got a shield so strong, hardly anything will dent it. But I have just the solution for that. There are three pilots oh, set up around okay. the area. Come on. All right. Go ahead. Oh, you already started it. Cool. Alright. Now let's see this XP. I'm not using Barry Mentats. Do I have those? Nope. All good. Let's do this. Oh yeah, here comes the XP. I need to put Mysterious Savior back on. Mm. 
Nah, Odious isn't like that bot. I used to play with him a lot back uh, when I was first starting 76. Good luck getting a fixture plan, guys. I got an imposter sheep squatch helmet. If anyone wants that. Dropping some uh, script on me. There you guys go. Hopefully that 28 gets it. I think he needs it the most. Here, let me hook up this level 28 with some things. Here. Let's get you situated. Oh no. See if you'll trade with me. Where did that low level go?
Anyone see? Oh well. Let's go do line in the sand. Plenty full. XP here. This event is awesome with a full server. Uh, I'm not sure, Cody. Yeah, Odious, I just read that. Yep. I'm going to attempt it. Maybe. A couple times. I think he's bored, Texas. Alright, let's initiate the pre combat check real quick. You got it, Toxic? Nice. Appreciate it. It looks like you made a oopsies there, Joe. You need a fusion core again? Not this time, bud. Not this time. <laughs> I'm telling you though, this is a great board event. You may not get a lot of legendaries from this. Maybe actually since the holiday scorch this year. Now that I think about it, actually. But typically you don't get a lot of legendaries. You just get a lot of XP. It's a great horde event to do. Not again, man. You can't play the boy who cried wolf. I'll be sure to drop script I get after the end of this. Might as well repair this doohickey air missile. I need to up my intelligence on my legendary perk card just to get me a little bit more intelligence too. So I feel like I'm still not getting that much XP. I mean, I'm getting a lot, but I feel like I can get more.
This is probably the best event for the Holiday Scorched. What the heck? No, they got pr plenty of new rewards. I got a few on me, actually. And the pre the presents, like the old duped ones, they don't count toward these. This is a whole new <laughs> loot table you're getting out of these new uh, presents this time around. So if you have old duped ones, you're not getting uh, the new rewards, which I like that. Eh, don't worry about it, assassin. Oh my gosh. Whoops. Did I just get spawn glitch? I got spawn glitch. Shoot. <laughs> Dang. Well, I guess that's going to wrap up this stream then. Um, I was going to wait to finish this event, but yeah. By the way, guys, um, I guess before I completely head out of here, if you want, feel free to donate. There's a pinned comment. Uh, that donation goes straight towards St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. And it's also going into the big pots for Fallout for Hope, which Fallout for Hope is this uh, event taking place where a bunch of the Fallout community is getting together trying to raise money for St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. So yeah, if you want, feel free to donate. Once again, it's in the pinned comment at the top. If I manage to reach the goal, I will be shaving my head and uploading it to YouTube. But 
Yeah, I don't know if we're going to make that or not. We'll see. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in. Appreciate you guys. Have a good one.